wrong with my son, y'all? I figured it out. I figured it out. See, they've been in these LA streets so long. They've been in these streets. <laughs> and they couldn't pull nobody even, even six foot four. Close to 200 pounds. <laughs> they, look what they walk around with. They mad. They so mad. They couldn't pull something halfway as decent as they mama. You almost had it. You almost had it. You almost had it. You should have been nice to Megan. You should have been nice, okay? She wanted you to bend over, nigga. You should have bent over, okay? You should have been nice. My sons is literally fucking pissed. They so pissed right now. Like, that's not my fault. That's not my fault. <laughs> I didn't tell y'all to do that. <laughs> I told you not to do that. Now they mad. Listen now they mad. Listen to your mammy. Listen to your mammy. Y'all mad because y'all running around. Got to walk up and get y'all billboard awards and shit walking around with your granny. That's not my problem, nigga. <laughs> You should have you should have listened to your mama they mad because people out here saying they mama look good and ain't saying nothing about they babies they baby they bms that's why they mad i already know why they mad you see how he tried to come for me right after i got my celebrity ship <laughs> he tried to come for me boy why because they because your baby mama had to wear sunglasses and i walked up in that bitch like bow he mad because his baby mama had to wear sunglasses. <sighs> Gotta wake that bitch up in the morning and put her ass on a treadmill. That's all I can tell you, baby. Gotta be in here pumping this iron. You gotta keep your shit tight. You gotta keep your shit together, okay? You can't be sitting at home cooking every five minutes, cooking them nasty ass meals that don't nobody wanna eat, okay? I, I should have taught you how to fake that shit, bitch. I woke up this morning. I ran over to to the uh, local uh, omelet joint. I put that shit on a plate, and I pulled my ass up to the gym, okay? Don't let nobody have you put no sunglasses on, bitch. That's your face. You got to wear that motherfucker. <laughs> I wouldn't dare. Even if I wasn't halfway what I am, nigga, you would never get me to put no sunglasses on. I would rock that shit like this what it is. You couldn't, you couldn't get me to be uh, unconfident. I'm big as fuck right now. You didn't, did I carry that shit like that? Hell no. Y'all half my age trying to stand next to me. It ain't gonna never fucking happen. Sorry. It ain't my fault. You should have did like your daddy. <laughs> the bliggity bliggity black don't crack. Hey, Kylissa might as well just go ahead and be a comedian, bruh. She funny as hell, bruh. She be going in on Jaden, bruh. I guess she can't say shit about Kushar no more. So she just got to put all that energy towards Jaden. Man, this is one strange-ass relationship, like, mother and son. Like, me and my mother would never talk to each other like this. Never. Like, I don't know what the hell done led up to this point. Everything is for the camera. Everything is for the internet. And why she keep on comparing herself to... Her son's girlfriend, tell me something. You mad that your BMs don't look like me, black and chocolate and all this stuff. This shit is crazy. It is so crazy. Because all Blueface do, he be doing all the self-hate shit, talking about black woman this, black woman that, and trying to big up Jaden while I turn down black woman. So it's already some self-hate shit. Ain't no telling what the hell Carlissa was putting in her kid's head as they was getting older. She always talk about Blueface private parts and all this shit. Man, and she going in on her ass. It looked like she was working out in the gym. And her friend in the background co-signing that shit. They always say birds of a feather flock together. Because if she had any real friends, if her husband was a real man, like, man, bitch, put the camera down. Like, everything is not for show. She claimed that she doing all this shit for promotion. This ain't working. This shit would have been worked. Every time she get on live, she'll have like 5,000 people watching she want to say she got 50 million, 5 million people. Like, her ass is delusional. She do be having me tripping, though. Like, don't get me wrong. She be having me tripping. But as far as, like, being a real mother and a real grandmother to her kids, like, she not that. And as her grandkids get older, they're going to look at all this shit on the internet. The same way with their parents. They're going to see the whole shit on the internet. And they're going to want to disassociate themselves from the shit. 
Because they ain't going to want to be a part of this clown ass circus. The whole family beefing with each other, talking about each other every goddamn day. And you would think that she'd get tired of talking about her kids all the time, but shit, she not. She's just getting started, man. What y'all think about this? Your boy B, make sure you subscribe.